When I was working with the federal government, like you just heard, for 34 years, 25 of those 34 years were partnering with professionals like yourself in the area of acquisition, contracting, and procurement. I was the contracting officer. I was the regional chief procurement officer. I was the person that's working with our customers, our stakeholders, working with yourselves, our property managers, our IT personnel, to acquire all the goods and services that we needed for the Department of Defense and the Department of Treasury in terms of our mission, vision, and core values. So when it comes to behavioral ethics, when it comes to using your influence, not just in terms of what you do, but also what you say, your example, because you're a role model, it, it makes a big difference because people are watching. I'm gonna be referring to you during these 50 minutes as leaders because each and every one of you are leaders. It's not tied to your position and it's not tied to your title, but you are a leader and people are watching. The taxpayers are looking for you for help. The executive orders that come from the President of the United States need to be complied with, and we need leaders like yourselves, professionals like yourselves as a part of this organization and the agencies that you represent to have the highest ethical standards and use your influence to make a positive impact in the lives of others.